What's up everyone, my name is Ali and welcome to the multiplayer footage you will have seen from the latest Strike Package uh, trailer. I've taken all of the gameplay and just the gameplay and slowed it down for you guys so you can see what's happening without having to watch the trailer over and over because all of it flies by so quickly, especially in something as fast edited as the trailer. So I wanted to slow it all down, uh, point out things that I noticed so you're not missing out on anything and any information you're not uh, may not have uh, seen or heard of already. Um, so for those of you guys that weren't as keen-eyed as me, you may not have seen the golden gun that was actually in this trailer, and that will come up very shortly, so hang around for that. And uh, if you haven't seen my other video, I've actually shown some other Modern Warfare 3 gameplay. Here you can see that the screen has got no HUD, that means that the EMP is in the game for sure, just to point that out, out to you guys really quickly. Um, if you haven't seen my other video, I actually show um, some more Modern Warfare 3 gameplay as well, and just on the screen there, you will have seen the small little icon next to his name showing 5 stars and the rank 80, just to confirm that 80 is indeed the highest rank. So jumping into it you will have seen a new there are a big sort of automatic, semi-automatic noob tube. That is really, really weak. Um, all of the noob tubes in this game are really, really weak, do not worry about that. Um, they've been stepped down in terms of damage massively so even two hits may not kill them uh, and one certainly you're going to have to be very unlucky to be killed by one. Um, so prestige, the max prestige has been unconfirmed as of yet. Um, I'm guessing there's going to be about 15 like Black Ops but that again is unconfirmed. Uh, there are no customizable emblems like they were in Black Ops however they're going back to the uh, unluckable emblems and titles that we loved in Modern Warfare 2 and perps um, personally I think that uh, actually kept Modern Warfare 2 alive longer um, than Black Ops because of the ability to sort of aim for those really hard um, emblem emblems and titles like a thousand chopper gunner kills a thousand here we go this is it the golden shotgun first golden gameplay of um, a gun in modern warfare t uh, 3 and I can explain how to get that in a second um, but yeah of course the title and emblems are a fantastic way to add long longevity to the game and uh, for people to play it even more um, but on the screen here we can see the fact that we do indeed get uh, perks for killing people and um, basically turn yourself into a super powered soldier and then just after that in the trailer they said that the game's really balanced so obviously they've tried their best to make this game and uh, kill streaks as balanced as possible or, sorry point streaks now um, and I'm sure that it will be balanced the fact that you can't have any air support for, um, from that um, given strike package but um, the golden gun how do you get it well I've mentioned this in the video a while ago but I'll bring it all up for you guys again so you can know what's happening um, essentially each gun will have its own rank and when you rank up this gun um, You'll be able to get new attachments, new camos, etc. And once that gun is maxed out to its highest level, which I believe is 40s for that level for the gun, so the guns have its own separate level. Once you reach that highest level, you will get uh, the golden camo automatically, and you don't have to have prestige to, do to have done this. So that means that anyone and everyone, whatever level, as long as they're maxing out their gun level, can uh, actually get gold camo, which is really really cool. Um, so what else do we have in here? We saw the heartbeat sensor quite a lot. Luckily the range of a heartbeat, uh, heartbeat sensor have been reduced dramatically uh, to a point where you're going to have to be moving really, really slowly and it could actually be a hindrance at some points. Um, you know, if, if you're sort of trying to wait for someone to appear on your um, tiny um, motion sensor, it may actually lead to someone just running around the corner and quickly picking you off that you realizing it may not be the best thing. Um, and if you haven't noticed in the bottom right corner, there is in fact a kill streak or a point streak count so this will go up each time you get a kill each time you capture a flag etc and capturing a flag is only or tends to only be one point there are only very rare occasions where you actually get two um, so there aren't massive bonuses for that and here's actually one of the new camos uh, it looks very much like a sort of woodland a mixture between a woodland and some sort of um, desert camo because of its redness um, which looked really cool and you may have seen the blue camo on the AK as well which leads me on to the next point um, the guns that they tend to show in the multiplayer trailers tend to be the guns that you get really early on, which sort of hints at the fact that you get both the SCAR and the AK at a really low level, which I personally think is really cool because I've always liked the AK um, and the M4 here as well. All of them I reckon you get at a really low level, which is good news, um, really good standard assault rifle classes. Uh, we saw the P90 as well from the SMG classes, that's really cool. Um, so we've got so much information here guys, I really hope you enjoyed. Um, this has been all the gameplay from the trailer, slowed down for you guys so you can see exactly what's happening. If you'd like to check out my Road to Modern Warfare 3 series where I play Modern Warfare 2 live leading up to the release of Modern Warfare 3, feel free to do so. I'll have so much gameplay up on release day which is the 8th of November. Uh, my channel will definitely be the place to check out on the release day for Modern Warfare 3. Um, so I hope you enjoyed, feel free to click any of the links in the top left hand side of the screen and I look forward to seeing you in my future videos.